Hey guys, yeah, uh, Steve here, obviously. Now, I'm at the bottom of Ormond Place, um, and directly behind me, you've probably already seen on Google Maps, um, we have this uh, Melbourne Water Basin, which, if you can see here, so the property is technically in a floodplain, which is a consideration that we'll need to look at. Dandenong Range is up here, uh, so what this area, whole area is, is to say is that if, uh, if there is heavy rain, we're going to get a fair bit of flow coming down off the hills, and it is considered that the basin here will capture, um, it's like a storm water kind of capture point, um, but <clears throat> probably can't tell here, the houses over here are certainly probably one of the lowest points around as far as I can see okay so that is going to be a consideration now what you will notice is that the road is the lowest point and it appears that all the homes are are somewhat you know three four feet worth of elevation um, to either side of the road sorry there's a bit of wind here so that might interrupt the the commentary um, but yeah I just want to give you a good feel albeit a floodplain it would probably require an awful lot of rain for it actually to flood the homes so this could be I'm not saying it is but it could be a good example of although the postcode is technically a floodplain it is probably most unlikely that the houses will actually be flooded it would take an enormous amount of water um, to to flood the homes but you can see here all the homes are of similar age um, subdivision so this is this is furthermore we talk about the subdivision I haven't seen one that's been subdivided and the agent did inform me that there is okay, I'm just looking at this one here that there is a restrictive covenant on title stopping the subdivision 11 looking at the numbers 10 11 no so these are all original there's no infills anywhere albeit they, a lot of them do have the potential the site access required so that will be worth consideration for our master plan for future developments but uh, as we know these rules and boundaries and uh, council um, restrictions can change in time but um, yeah I just wanted to give you a feel from this side I'll also give you another view from the top end um, but overall the location is really charming really nice obviously it's a beautiful day today in Melbourne but you can see here you know there's there's every single house there's lots of off-street parking so the, the roads really quiet um, there's no sign of any any unsociable behavior and what I mean by that is all the gardens are beautifully maintained and I just think it's a genuinely a really nice neighborhood Okay, cool. Um, yep, yeah, like I say, I'll, this will now probably bounce. I'm going to go back to the property because we're a few minutes to the inspection, so I'm a little bit early. Um, so we'll, we'll, we'll pick it up from the other end of the road or, or maybe a separate video.